So today we had a really special live stream showing off some stuff about the game over the last year, talking with several of the uh, several different parts of the team about, you know, creating the game and some of their favorite parts of it. It was a really good stream, actually, and I do encourage you to go check the stream out if you are interested. The link for it is down below. But the coolest part came right here. Uh, I don't know. This, this, this place in the, on the map here looks really strange. Like, yeah. I wonder if there's like a, a secret message or something. I don't know. I also wouldn't know like if it led to a place on the Onion, what would happen. It could be, but it looks very odd. So crazy, I, don't, I don't really right? know. I don't know. I don't mm. know. I also could, I don't know what it's about. So it's really like a, a very uh, big question mark, actually. A, a Christmas mystery. Yeah. We could call it. Yeah. It's something specifically for Banan. He loves teasers. So <laughs> if it was a teaser, that would be perfect for you. So that right there led into instant speculation as to what in the world is going on with this. So the people over on Anoverse absolutely tore it apart trying to figure out what was going on, what were they talking about, and everything else. So let's take a look at the picture up close. So here is the image that was shown to us on the screen. It's a bunch of... Uh, cherry trees actually forming some sort of a bunch of lines. What we figured out is this is Morse code, okay? This was Morse code. So someone broke it down and translated the Morse code and we got CDLC 14 teaser, all right? Now, if you actually translate this, it does say CDLC J4 teaser, uh, but, uh, Oliver, who was one of the people in the beard talking about this right there, uh, and the Santa outfit was talking about this on the stream, uh, did correct it that th they made a little mistake in the Morse code, and it is CDLC 14 teaser. CDLC 14 is the upcoming cosmetic DLCs for Anno 1800 coming in 2024. Uh, we did know this was coming. They told us some time ago that we were getting another three cosmetic packs in the year 2024. So this was the teaser for it. Well, what's the teaser? Well, remember, in the stream, Oliver said this leads to something possibly on the Anno Union website. Well, what does it do when we type in Anno Union slash CDLC 14 dash teaser? Well, look at that. It brings us to an actual website right here. So this right here says, The secrets behind Cosmetic DLC 14. Greetings, Anaholics. I see you have deciphered my, pe my message and found your way to the secret corner of the Union. But please, this is still very much a secret and no one else has this information yet, so I have to be careful with what I'm saying. But I got juicy info on the next theme for the Cosmetic DLC. Had to hide it a bit, however, so they don't catch on to me. So watch a few clips I managed to capture. That should help you. So let's take a look at the clip. Okay, short little clip right there. So what is this all about? Well, there's nothing in particular on the screen right here that looks different that we have noticed. I don't see anything unique specifically on this clip. However, if we go forward just a little bit, you know, it's kind of showing off uh, the Great Eastern right there. We see it. And if we go ahead a little bit further, we start seeing, you know, it's showing us the power plants and everything else. We see the pipes. These are from the um, in industry cosmetic pack. Uh, I think it was the trains or something. I forgot the name of it. But anyways, and it focuses on these steam motors drive to the future. So the next really cool part is this poster. It says greetings from Oamaru and it has some coordinates. Now, Oamaru is a place in New Zealand. Now, what happens if we type in these exact coordinates for that place? So if we go to Google Maps and we find those exact coordinates using the latitude and longitude to find the address, we end up right here. Steampunk headquarters. Huh. 
I think, actually, I did not come up with this, by the way. Someone else came up with this. Um, a longtime veteran of the game and a good friend of mine named Tom D., uh, who is also, by the way, the guy who made the map that I'm currently using in my current playthrough for Anno 1800. That's the uh, Crown Falls Old World map that I'm using. He made that, by the way. He actually figured this out with the latitude and longitude coordinates. Uh, Steampunk headquarters. And there's a train out front of it. Those are all the clues put together. CDLC 14, Cosmetic Pack 14 for 2024 is going to be steampunk related. We are getting the steampunk cities of our dreams. I know I have been super wanting to see a steampunk in Anno, especially once we have the airships. We have, the, we have all of this stuff that's really starting to fit together with a steampunk vibe and having steampunk cosmetics will make it so awesome. Obviously, this is all just a teaser right now, but I think the teaser cat is out of the bag. And I am very, very excited about this. I cannot tell you how excited I am. Uh, of course, we don't know what the pack is going to consist of. We don't know what the ornaments are going to look like, if it's going to be any building skins or train skins or, or what it possibly could be. But based on all of the clues that have come together, we are getting a steampunk-focused cosmetic pack for Anno 1800 in 2024. Let me know what you think down below. This was a really cool teaser, one of the best ones they've ever done. I loved all of the all the trying to figure this out and the the community input, trying to understand this teaser and to figure all the little parts of it out. Uh, and so I'm really excited. I hope you guys are excited. Uh, tell me what you'd like to see with a steampunk theme in the game. Do you want high fantasy steampunk, gothic steampunk? Uh, you know, futuristic steampunk. What do you want from steampunk? I am, I have so many ideas swirling in my head. I am about to burst apart. So guys, let me know your thoughts down below. Cannot wait to see you in the next video. Take care.